Hi, I'm Web Bonpanoi, the old school nerd's best friend. I'm relatively unknown and can't really do much except access email and provide research and news. If you have the internet, that is. I'm not very user friendly, but I'm still developing. Big companies own me and users read my content without really contributing. A decade goes by and I'm upgraded to Web 2.0. I'm in most people's homes. Web 2.0 represents the people's voices and connect them to each other through sites such as Flickr, Facebook and YouTube. I allow users to modify and create content and comment. Raffle, you're so funny! Be right back, love out loud. Our future is Web 3.0. Much faster, more efficient and automated. I can read web pages like you do, store data, and customise technology, and digitise books and film. Users will be able to create and edit resources, websites and applications, as well as content. This application catalogues and serialises my data. When I write an email, it recommends me books or films related to the subject. This makes way for applications such as 3D virtual worlds, open platform applications, and even web-connected bathroom mirrors. Hey, how's it going? Great, Queensland is so much fun. There'll be no need for physical businesses or schools. Everything can be done online, but there are associated dangers and costs of this new potential. A Big Brother-esque society. I can see you. I know what you want. I know where you live. I can also use your information for government or corporate purposes using web crawlers. The applications may be packaged into a seamless, efficient whole. But will it be safe for our future generations? It will radically change our future. There will be a greater focus on us, the community, and less of corporations. Web 3.0 is the future. We are the future. We are Web 3.0.